Hey everyone, Presito here. So in today's video, I'm going to be talking about Mode Network and their upcoming potentially huge airdrop campaign. I'm going to be telling you a bit about what Mode Network is and then showing you step-by-step -step guide on how to participate in the airdrop to maximize your potential gains. So you can see here the first step is get your referral code and invite some friends. That will be the main way probably to make the most from this. Then you'll want to interact with their ecosystem and you can earn up to 2x points and at the moment they have Kim Exchange, Ionic and Mode NS which is their ENS. So let's start off with their ENS. So we go to Space ID here you can search for any domain name that you want to register. So for example I searched dump and that was available. So here you can choose how many years just leave that at one don't tick set as primary name otherwise it ties it to your account. Then you just click register as you can see 0.02 Ethereum, obviously, depending on what you register, it'll differ. So I'm going to confirm that transaction, and you can see my TX is pending, and then I will have registered this domain name, and that will help contribute to um, the airdrop campaign. Also, then what I'd recommend is actually to mint more than one. So I'm just going to mint two, actually, just to be safe. So here you can search some other domain names. So I'm just going to search some random ones, Uniswap, and then you can see it when it drops down here, if it's available or not. You can see this one unfortunately isn't so let me just search something that's definitely not taken pro 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 so i'm going to search that it's available if i click here you can see it's 0 0.002 ethereum which is just five dollars obviously the more popular the name the more expensive it will be so i'm just going to register this one as well so there we go i've done two domain names so i know for sure okay with this part of the airdrop i've contributed what i can and it will hopefully allocate me the extra points Next up, you want to go to app.ionic.money, which is this link over here, and connect your wallet. And then you'll want to deposit some wrapped Ethereum. So as you can see here, I can click on wrapped Ethereum. I'm just going to put 0 0.01 and then wrap that. It will pop up in your wallet. You just confirm that transaction and you wait for it to be processed. So once that is processed, you see it, you just click continue. And there we go, you are done. And next up, you'll want to go to Kim Exchange, which is basically their DEX. So I actually bridged 0 0.1 Ethereum, I think, to Mode Network, which actually you should do first, which I'll show you shortly. So here you just want to do a swap. So I'm just going to swap some Ethereum to USDT here. So that will pop up in your wallet and you just confirm the transaction and you just do a couple swaps like this and show you interacting with their dApps and so on. So once that is done, then you can actually just swap back again. So I'm just actually going to go and swap that USDT back to Ethereum. So that'll make you approve USDT. So you approve it in your wallet and then you swap it back to Ethereum. So that is what I'd recommend you to do. And it is worthwhile doing a couple of these type of swaps. You don't need to just do one or two. You can keep using it. I'm sure the higher the volume, uh, more chances to maximize your airdrop. So I've approved it and then I'm going to proceed to swap. So now that that's done, I'm going to be showing you about bridging. So that's also a really important point. Obviously, you have to start off with bridging to mode in order to use these. So that's why I should have actually showed you that first, but now you know. So you just go over here where it says bridge at to earn points. You click on the bridge here and you connect to your mate mask, obviously on Ethereum network, if you're bridging from Ethereum to mode, then you can also bridge back which is really nice. Unlike Blast, you can't bridge back until when mainnet is live. But here you can bridge back, but it does take about seven days for the transaction to process. So keep that in mind. You will have to wait a significant amount of time. But if you do bridge back, then you stop accruing points. So it's important to keep it on mode. Obviously, don't put in what you can't afford to lose and so on. So here you just go to Ethereum to mode. And here you can put how much you want to bridge. You can see I've got two Ethereum available. You can just put one Ethereum. And obviously you have to switch your Ethereum and then bridge. So it's really quick and simple in terms of that bridge. And then you'll start accruing the rewards. Thanks for watching and I'll see you guys next time.